Martita, welcome to the show. Thanks for having me, Velder. This is Martita Hara with all you. Oh, I got it. Martita Hara. Oh, I like yes. that. Yeah. Oh, that's so sexy. Oh, I like that. Martita, thank you for joining us. It's springtime. I'm in Dallas, Texas, so it's really springtime. Oh, that's where I live now. I just moved to Dallas. Oh, you're going to love it. It is. It's the greatest place on earth, and I'm not even from Dallas. <laughs> I'm loving every moment there. It's fantastic. It is. And yes, the- spring is here, and we're seeing tons of fruits and vegetables in our market right now and we want to take advantage of that especially this month march is national nutrition month so we want to take advantage of all those beautiful fruits and vegetables that we're finding in the market and aside from that it's also the start of california strawberry season and thank goodness california strawberries are always in season so let's use them on our sweet dishes on our savory dishes because they're not just delicious, they're actually really good for us. They have tons of dietary fiber in there, vitamins, antioxidants, they're low in sugar. I mean, they're great on sweet dishes, savory dishes, fresh or frozen, go with strawberries. Okay, Martita, okay, so we saw you on the Next Food Network star, now you're on the OWN Network, Homemade Simple, okay, great. Give us a quick dish that we can make. Show, show us that you're really a star, what can I make? <laughs> well, we've got a great dish here right now. I've got a black bean strawberry quinoa spinach salad, which is delicious. You know, for me, I love really mixing it up. I like to touch all those notes, you know, something sweet, something savory, something salty, something vinegary. You know, let's just try to think about that when we're creating ma- meals. Hit all of those notes, and this salad does just that. But also, we don't want to be in the kitchen the entire time, right? We want to enjoy our friends and family when they come over. And I know they're going to be coming over for Easter, for Mother's Day. So for that, I'm going to choose a honey-baked ham. These premium meats are fully cooked. They're ready to serve. And this crunchy glaze on this honey-baked ham, I've been eating it all morning. It is delicious. So you can choose the original honey-baked ham or the roasted or smoked turkey. Either way, your friends and family are going to love you. Yeah, that's great to have the centerpiece already done for you. That saves you a lot of time. It really does. I mean, when I'm entertaining, I don't make everything from scratch. I make a couple of things at home, and then you definitely need to have some of those ready-bought, ready-to-serve items. I mean, that's how you entertain. That way you can enjoy your guests. Well, okay, uh, so Easter's coming. Fruits and vegetables mm-hmm. are, are bound for Easter. Any ideas for, for that celebration for us? Well, I love to make pestos all year long. So this time of the year, I'm making it with artichokes, basil, a little bit of goat cheese, some toasted almonds, fruity vegetable oil. Pestos are great with pasta, with fish, with chicken. I love to spread it on a sandwich even. And I love breakfast sandwiches. They remind me of home. And for my breakfast sandwiches, I use Eggland's Best Eggs. They stay fresher longer than any other brand of eggs. They have 25% less saturated fat. And they have double the omega-3 fatty acids and four times the vitamin D. And honestly, I love eggs. You give me a poached or fried egg anytime with anything and I'm a happy girl. That's at my house. We can't keep (laughs) eggs. I'm so serious. I know you got a a chocolate granola, and I know we don't have enough time. Can we go online and find that? Yes. Go to my website. Go to martitahara.com. You will find my crunchy, fruity granola. I have a couple of granola recipes on there and tons of other recipes and ideas there for you. So please visit me on martitahara.com. And you can also visit us at moretipsforyou.com. We have all these recipes that we talked about here today on there and tons of entertaining tips for you. Martita, it was a pleasure talking to you. I'm going to run into you. It's a pleasure talking to you. I'm looking forward to running to you at Central Market, Whole Foods, or something in Dallas. Oh, I'm sure we'll see each other. It's a small town. It's a big town, but with a small town feel. It is. Thank you, Martita. I really, really appreciate you you coming on the show, and I look forward to talking to you soon. We'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.